K-pop has captivated the world and dominated the charts, and now it has finally made its way to Broadway. So today, I am popping in rehearsals of K-pop the Musical to give you a first look. Helen, we are finally talking K-pop the Musical coming to Broadway. It kind of feels like timing is right now. Yes, it definitely feels right. We've learned a lot while working on the show, and K-pop as a genre evolved so much. Now, uh, when I first started working on it in 2014, like not a lot of people knew about the genre, and now everybody knows yep. it. Everybody listens to it on a daily basis, and yeah, it's just so great to be able to share this work um, with the audience right now. So the story of K-pop is a fictional K-pop star named Wee goes off stage on the biggest night of her career, and it sends ripple effects through her entire label, including an eight-piece boy band named Fate and a five-piece girl band named Artemis. There's a lot of choreography. I mean, K-pop, the music, the dance, it like all comes together to create this amazing visual that is like part of the culture, and now we're like taking that and putting a real spin on it to make it part of our musical. True story, before we started rolling, I said, I'm gonna ask you to teach me a move, and they go, we can't, it's too hard. <laughs> so just give us one small, tiny little thing that we can do to try to be like a morsel as cool as they are in that room. We'll teach you just like a little bit of one of our point dances. Okay. Left shoulder, right shoulder, index, V, and index again. The lyrics goes, this is my Korea. Six, seven, go. This is my Korea. Oh, you got it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I grew up in Seoul, South Korea, and I moved to the U.S. when I was nine, and I brought all of my K-pop CDs and cassette tapes with me, because this is before the days of cell phones, internet, uh, and those CDs and those cassettes were really a sense of my home. And so when this opportunity arose, I thought, oh, what a great way to talk about some of the big things that I've been thinking about since I was nine years old. Yeah. Like, what is family? What is home? How do, you fit as a, how do you fit in as an outsider? Those kinds of big questions. There has never been a Korean story on Broadway, ever. And it really is an honor to share a little bit of my culture, my people, and you know our art. K-pop is such a pride for Korean people and for me to be able to you know play a small part in in bringing that to this you know land of dreams this like you know the street of dreams Broadway it's just incredible and it's such an honor for me and so I hope that people can see that joy that pride and that honor that I am experiencing right now.